Hi, and welcome to Tipsy Tuesday here at the Texas Photographer. My name is Deborah Chetwood, and I am the Texas Photographer. Today we're going to talk about a little hidden secret in Photoshop that I think you might enjoy. Do you ever cruise around on different websites and um, really like a color combination, but wonder about how to go about getting that? You could try to download the image um, in the, the different text and play with it and see if you can do it, but there's a little secret in Photoshop that they don't quite advertise. So I'm going to go in and just create a new file real quick here. And we could go in and use a paintbrush once we selected a color and um, fill it in, that kind of stuff. But we're trying to get over here into another one. Now I could go about it by the color picker over here, but I wanted to stress again how I'm not an advocate of just filling in paint colors via a paintbrush. If you're going to do an all over background, I always suggest coming down to this button here and selecting solid color. And from there you can, of course, go in and pick your color that you're interested in. Now, you'll notice while I'm in this window, there is no um, eyelet dropper. But when I move out into Photoshop, there is. When you see your eyedropper, hold down the left key on your mouse and scroll over into the window of the website that you're looking at and put it over the color that you want. Once you do, release it and instantly it's in Photoshop. How cool is that? Very exciting. So now you can do that. And by the way, it's not just for the web. Even if you wanted to, to select it from an image that you have on your desktop or in a folder, it's the same principle. Find your eye drop, hold it down, come over here, select the colors you want, and select OK. That's it for this week. A short little tip. I hope you enjoyed. This is Deborah Chetwood with the Texas Photographer. Until next time, cheers.